Welcome to SharePoint 2013 Quick Tip, Calendar Overlay. This is Administrator Training, and I'm Trainer Laurie. First, select the calendar by clicking the name. Then click the Calendar tab so you can see the tools. Then click Calendars Overlay, and it will ask for a new calendar. So click the new calendar, and then click OK. The maximum number of calendars to overlay or view at once is 10. Now we're in Settings, Calendar Overlay Settings. First, enter the exact name of the calendar to overlay. Then select SharePoint. You do have the option to select Exchange, but this training is just about how to bring a SharePoint calendar into SharePoint. Then it's a good idea to add a description, but that is optional. And then choose a color from the list. There are only nine colors available, so if you have ten calendars that you want to overlay, you won't have a, a unique color for each. Then paste the exact link from the calendar to overlay. I would suggest that you open a new page in your browser to obtain the calendar link. Then click the Resolve button. Then, after you've clicked Resolved, you have more options under List. So click the drop-down and choose which calendar to add to the overlay. You want to make sure it's the same calendar that you have the name. And then click a View if they are available. Generally, it's just Calendar View, but you might want to have a List View or some other kind of view if it's available in that calendar. And then make sure that you click to show the calendar in the overlay. If you don't click Always Show, it won't and then click OK. It will create a master calendar with, in this case, uh, all 10 calendars and they will show up as a legend on the left and that color will sync within the calendar.